Andy. What are you sitting on that little chair for? Just well, that was dangerous. Oh. What do you want? Um, the play. Talking to one of my contacts. You need Barry from EastEnders. Yeah. And uh, he's got a friend who's an actor. He's just had a meeting with Sir Ian McKellen, who's directing a new play. So right. I put in some calls, and you've got a meeting with McKellen on Wednesday. Really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't like to see how there's some nice birds around there. I suppose so. Andy will be ready in about five minutes. Cheers. Five minutes is all I need. What? Steve Sherwood. What's your name? Susie. Nice to meet you, Susie. What time do you finish here? About ten o'clock. Right. Do you mind if I give you a call? Sure. OK. What's your number? I'll speak to you later. OK. Claire. Oh. Respect, man. Darren Lamb, agent to uh, Andy Roman. It's a Steve Sherwood friend of mine. Are you a friend of his? I don't think so. This guy's an absolute player. <laughs> Respect again. Listen, if we're talking about the honeys, um, there's a chick I got my eye on, actually. Um... Who? Her. Maggie. Maggie? Yeah. Forget it. Yeah, from what I've heard, she's uh, pretty easy. Yeah, she's not that easy. <laughs> Good luck. How would you approach it? I mean, what sort of... Just walk straight up to her and say, I've been admiring you from afar for a long time and I haven't said anything, but I would love to take you out one night and see if we have as good a time as I think we will. Would you like to have dinner with me sometime? Bang. OK. Don't think about it, just do it. Just do it. No, don't do it, please. Well, he says do it. Get over there, go on. Oh, look at him. Maggie. Hello, sorry. Hi. Um, just wanted to let you know that I've been uh, watching you secretly without you knowing, and um, be very keen to spend the night with you and see if you uh, enjoy it as much as I know I will. And um, happy to pay for it as well, if, you know, for dinner, if you want to, oh. if you eat dinner, well, obviously you eat dinner. Mm -hmm. Are you asking me out? Yeah. You want to cook me dinner? I can cook you dinner if you want, yeah. Can you cook? Yes. Yeah, OK, then. Really? Yeah. OK, cool. I'll give you a call, shall I? Yeah. Yeah. See you later. Bye. What'd she say? She said yes. Really? Sure. Oh, my God. It's worse than I thought. She's at rock bottom. Yes, she has. <laughs> Do you know what? I've never seen him even try and chat up a woman. No, 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 because I wouldn't do it in front of you, would I? I'm actually beginning to think he might be a bit gay. No, 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 no. Join a club. Well, no, don't join any club, because oh, yeah. I'm not. Yeah, sure, you, you could chat up a woman, right? Yes, now. if I wanted to, yeah. Go on, then. I don't want to. We've both done it. Go on, this one coming now. Go on. Mm. Go on. No, no, no. Hi. Hi, do you know what uh, time we finished tonight? I don't know, about ten-ish, I think. Ten, eh? Hey? I want to... I don't know what time we finished. Cheers. <coughs> I was unlucky. She answered me and everything, 10 o'clock. She said, you know, are you still? Sparkling. <coughs> she definitely noticed. 